Hey guys, it's Final Master Link, and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger. And last time, uh, we just kicked some ass, more or less, with a uh, frog. And now that we saved Queen Lean, um, Luca, or no, not Luca, Maro should be back. The Princess Nadia, as they call her also. So let's go back and see if she's back. <clears throat> what do you know she is back? Apparently she doesn't have her dress this time. And she says she was somewhere cold, dark, and lonely. So I'm guessing it might have been Detroit, maybe? Who knows? And she apologizes how she didn't mean to deceive us. And she basically explains that she wants your dick, more or less. Yeah, you're wrong. I would have taken you to the fair anyways. Yeah, let's go home. Fuck this place. And we go downstairs again. I know I'm kind of pointing out the obvious, but, uh... Yeah, so how are, how's everyone doing, huh? It's, um... What's the date? February 3rd, 2013. Anyone who is a fan of football knows that it's the Super Bowl today. I do not like sports at all, really, so... I don't really give a damn about the Super Bowl. Shit, I don't, I'm not even sure who's playing the Super Bowl, honestly. You know, whatever. Who cares? Oh my god. Oh, fuck. Um. See, I might save over a file, actually. Uh, actually, no. I can't, I can't be bothered to. It's not like we're really gonna accomplish anything in this recording ses session. Yeah, I know it's been a long time since I recorded anything. Or should I pick or should I say posted anything related to games? It's all been about ponies. Now I do like my ponies, but I also love my games. Now now if there is such a thing as a pony game that was like on a trigger style, that'd be fucking awesome. It would be the shit. Let's kill these assholes. They bug me. Kicking some ass and taking some names. That's what Chrono and his team does best. Hypno Wave and Aura and Aura Whirl. Aura and Aura Whirl, that is a healing technique. The duo tech Aura Whirl will heal everyone in the party at once, while Aura will only target a specific person. Hypno Wave, I believe that puts all the enemies to sleep. I think. Actually, let's, let's just do uh, right now, actually. As soon as as soon as these um blue eaglets try to rape us, yes, it puts it puts it puts all enemies to sleep supposedly. Wow, it didn't even fucking work. Hey, yeah, you gotta love it. I doubt those thing. I doubt that works on bosses either. So I probably won't even try it. Um, yeah, we can kill these guys, too. It's all about experience for, uh, Marl at this point, really. And they're not that tough at all. Actually, I could probably buy a weapon or two for, um, Luca and Marl, but... 
we're gonna get better weapons like just a little bit later anyway so it doesn't really matter let's see what level is moral anyway five huh all right well, first let's get it get the hell out of this forest now at this time period or this era as they would call it let's go to truce canyon we're gonna ignore those guys just because they don't really seem to be bothering us, so why bother them, right? And I got a couple of these assholes here. Man, there's something like really weird about the animation. Like it looks like it's trying to like bury your body or something. I mean they basically imitate Mario, they jump on you, try to crush you. Uh, and then they roll at you. Well, Mario doesn't do a lot of rolling. Maybe it's supposed to be, uh... I don't know, roly-poly or something. I don't know. And man, I have to say, if anyone lives in Indiana at this point, it really is fucking cold here. Like, right now it's 21 degrees outside, even though it's in the afternoon, but... You should have seen it just like a couple days ago. It was like um, low zero wind chill or something like that. It's fucking crazy. And like it figures like halfway through the fucking um, winter season. Like I was just thinking to myself, wow. Halfway through winter, it's actually not too bad so far. Because like um, before it didn't even go under like 30 degrees, which is nice in my opinion. Now all of a sudden, oh, we got, you know, wind chill below 10 degrees, and, you know, it, it'll probably be at least 15 tonight, at least. It's like, holy shit. At least we only have to deal with a couple more months of it. Thank God. There's that awesome effect again, I love that. It's just so badass. <clears throat> Yay, we're back. And Moral just seems to brush off the fact that she pretty much was non-existent. I can't move. Oh yeah, that's right. Moral basically says, uh, come, come to my house so we can do naughty things to each other. Actually, there's one thing I want to show off. I assigned a button to turbo, to a turbo controller, for the A button. So, like, I'll show you how, how much bullshit this is. Okay, I got five silver points. That's all you get. That is the only thing you get for a feeding net. That's fucking bullshit. I can never get more than, like, five of those anyways, normally. I had to fucking cheat to see um, how much you could get out of that, which isn't not, which isn't enough. I mean, if you want silver points, just kill the fucking robot like a bunch of times. He gives you three times as much anyway. It's bullshit. Um, I actually want to show off this too. If you go to Chrono's house with um, someone in your party, you'll kind of introduce them to your mother. Yeah, I'm sure you have seen her before. I think she only has like one line of, about him. Yeah, there's your cat. Meow, meow. I like cats. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned it before, but there is a point in the game where you can get your cat cat food. Uh, I think you get a power tab or something out of it. I'm not entirely sure. I know it's something kind of nice. And we got these assholes now. Come on. Uh, I don't know if I got that power tab in the previous recorded videos, but there is a power tab in the right side of the forest. I can probably show you real quick. Hold on. It should. It would be right here if I didn't already grab it. 
but I don't know. This is actually a different save file from the one that I already did when I recorded that, because you know that was like back in like last July, so I don't want to disturb that thing. That thing will call up more enemies to it. Hitake. I'm guessing that's some kind of a Japanese word. These things are fucking ugly as hell. They're also pretty weak as hell, too. <clears throat> Let's see, there's a little signpost there that'll just tell you that, hey, this is the castle. Dumb shit. And, it's, and the Chancellor kind of flips his shit when he says, when he sees Princess Nadia. And because we tampered with the past, he automatically jumps to conclusions. And he says that we kidnapped her and a load of shit, basically. Yeah, Crown's just like shaking his head like, what the fuck's wrong with these people? <sighs> these fucking soldiers are fucking retarded. So basically, we're on trial. Yes, our fate lies within the confines of the ju of the judiciary, judiciary, dude, within the fucking court. I can't fucking say that word for some reason. We have a lawyer, Pierre. Hopefully, he doesn't, you know, fuck us in the ass like he did, like Tim Robbins' lawyer did in the Shawshank Redemption. <laughs> I love in that movie how they always says. Lawyer fucked me. That's why I'm in here. Everyone's in everyone's innocent. I always love I love that movie. Always. And so basically, um the jury is gonna find us either innocent or guilty. And if basically if you're not an asshole, you should be not guilty. Like, um, there's certain things like um if you didn't check on the girl before you um, take the pendant, like it'll make you seem like you wanted to steal the pendant or something. And another one is if you didn't eat some old guy's lunch that was just sitting on the table. And um, just a number of things. And there's one where you have to uh, give a lost cat to a little girl to show that you know you mean well and stuff like that. I should be not guilty because I didn't really do anything wrong, but I, and then again I didn't really do anything right. But of course, common sense kind of plays into into this. Yeah, I, I I didn't I didn't even know she was rich, so how could I be tempted if I didn't know anything, dumbass? You see, at least your lawyer has your best interest. <laughs> See, first one not guilty. That guy is a good guy. That's a good Joe right there. But that that guy that guy's an asshole. Uh, that guy is not a douche at all. Notice how all the jury have the exact same sprites. I guess they couldn't bother to different different differentiate them. I can't fucking pronounce anything today. My language is shit now. I guess that's why I'm not an English major, I guess. I mean, I mean, the least they could have done is done, done like a palette swap or something. As, as you can see, a verdict has been reached and I've been found not guilty. But he still has to do shit like, uh, he ran off with a three day solitary confinement as punishment. That's still stupid in my opinion. But I guess it's better than, you know, being e executed or something. <sighs> Hooray, we're leaving. And Marl pretty much cries her little eyes out at that point. Uh, 
And as you can see, we're in handcuffs, and... I love how he says this, terrorist. You can't really, you can't really say terrorist nowadays without, you know, having a fucking jihad in, on everyone. You know, it's like yelling, it's like yelling bomb in an airport. You just, you just don't do that. And the chancellor is being a dick as always, and I'm kind of ignoring him because he's, he's just, an, he's a fucking idiot. We're gonna be taken away now. That's great. It's like he tried to shank me or something, I don't know. Animation looked a little weird. So yeah, the thing is, even if you are found guilty um, or not guilty, the effect is basically the same. Uh, this little beer will restore your HP and MP. I'm going to save here. And actually, uh, or th you see, this is the difference right here. This bag right here. If you're found not guilty, some sympathizers would bring you this stuff. And it is an ether, so that's why I did that. Um Yeah, it'll say two days, but yeah, I'll, I'll tell the I'll tell you that in the next part. Um I'm gonna split it, so I will see you guys later.